Today in mods, we are going to do Ender Pools, and the mod is basically every projectile shoots in a cluster. So like cluster bombs, you can now have dart bombs, dart cluster, boomerang cluster, basically anything you can think of. So I thought it'd be cool to, I don't know, do a chimps game on Ender Pools. Let's say all the way to round 120, see a couple new free play rounds as well. And Churchill too, Churchill. So let's give it a go. So unfortunately, if any of you know how uh, BTD Battles Indoor Pools works, uh, this map unfortunately is not coded to have balloons come from that other side. That said, I'm gonna start with the Dark Monkey. Take a look at that. We have a Dark Cluster, straight off the bat. So yeah, without the uh, other balloon lanes, it's honestly not that hard of a map. I think this was rated um, hard, advanced. Also, guess I'll have to drop a dart. I could drop a sniper, but I don't believe that shoots in a cluster. Not even shrapnel. So some towers are not affected. I took a look at it real quick. Mortar, not gonna use. I doubt factory works. Just think of projectiles, I guess. As I said. What happens if I use recursive cluster? Ah, interesting question. I could try that out later. Will it be like a recursive recursive cluster? That would be pretty sick. Alright, so I need to survive till uh, um, Churchill. How about a sub? Intel sub? We have Seeking Darts that... Oh my god. Seeking darts that when they when they hit balloons, they split into eight darts that also seek. Yeah, we found we, I think we found the OP tower. I, I think we found the right one. So anything that seeks, I think, yeah, pretty much the most OP in this mod. That is called a sub that will probably beat every round until we get Churchill. So, this map is perfect for, for Churchill because straight lines. And uh, yep. Yeah. I I don't know if I'll leave it on first or last. But, it doesn't matter because no balloons will even get past the corner with Church Churchill, look at this. As I said, I knew it was going to be good. Actually, do you see what's happening? I think it's actually better than what I even thought it would be. So, you know Churchill, uh, his attacks pierce through balloons. You notice that after each balloon it pierces through, it shoots its own cluster. So yeah, that is mega OP. Probably more broken than the sub, if I'm being honest. Now all we need is like a uh, black popping or a mib. Probably get that later. Take a look at that. I'll use the ability. Easy time. It is chimps. Because unlike other mods, I think it's definitely going to be a, a lot easier to do than just uh, plain terror mods with no modifiers. Oh right, we got a minigun too. Which I don't believe... Uh, no, it doesn't shoot in a cluster. Basically anything that can, I guess, instantly target. They don't have their own um, cluster attack. But that's not a big deal because again, all I need is to pop blacks. And then the other missiles will do the rest. I think I'll just straight buff Churchill, I guess. Why not? Alright, mob time. I don't know if the clusters are actually affecting the Moab. Part of me feels like it isn't. Let's watch here. Yeah, it doesn't. That's weird. Well, is it weird? I don't know. I feel like it should, but... Well, let's see what I want to do against it then. Clusters don't re-hit the same blue in. Um, does that still apply to the this upgrade. I think actually how NK codes it is that the clusters are basically just one. They're one projectile instead of like a bunch of mini ones. Maybe that's why it doesn't uh quite apply. 18. Let me just see if this is good enough. How about we'll, we'll just buy recursive. Wait what's going on? Hold on. I think my, my recursive is broken. Pretty much unusable broken. Let's see. Um. Okay so the recursive shot is pretty normal to me. But when it only shoots cluster, it, it it's pretty much broken. It, it does nothing. Well, there's your answer in case you want to see how it was, because it was awful. Alright, we'll get a quick double shot or something. How about Intel Airburst? I don't know. That's a lot of grapes. And there we go. So single target damage is going to suck, because yeah, the clustered projectiles don't hit the same balloon. Ouch. We'll get, we'll get, we'll probably get some tech. Other towers later that I guess we already have planned. I think I'll go for a Mib now. Yeah, let's go for a Mib now. Mib rush. Alright. Let's see what Never Miss does. Do the darts... Oh yeah, they do. They do. Now the, the cluster darts, they don't seek. Only the initial darts do. So not as OP as you might think. But still regardless, pretty OP. Let's use Churchill and yep. In innards are done with. Now, I was thinking, yeah, again, about getting rid of towers. That's why I maybe should have enabled selling. Should have enabled selling for zero dollars. But I think we'll find we'll find a workaround. Yeah, it's going to be very cluttered. That's why, again, I was hoping... Or maybe I should have enabled selling. So that we could see towers without 
having other towers in the way, because right now, uh, Nevermiss is kind of stealing the show. Holy crap. That's absolutely ridiculous. They actually feel like they're seeking. Uh, okay. I think how it works is that if a balloon's close enough, then the dart will seek, but otherwise, it'll just shoot straight forward. I believe that's how it's working, so it, I'm, I stand corrected. It does actually seek. All of them do. So with that, we probably survive to like round uh, 80. Uh, you have Ice Chinook Cell? Oh yeah, we do, we do. I guess I could do that, and actually that's a pretty good idea. I was also kind of thinking of uh, doing the Temple Sacrificing, but that's obviously more expensive. Now, it doesn't work because it only works on Towers on Water. Maybe for my next Towers, I should put them on Water so I can get rid of them if I need to. That sounds like a plan, because right now I, I can't get rid of this guy without Temple. Maybe I should have brought Adora for that. I'm not gonna upgrade a Spectre because, you see, we're slaying. If I, if I upgrade Spectre, we're, we're, we're gonna be like round 120, straight up. You can Shinook them to the Ice, yes, good idea. I sometimes forget about things. Can you Shinook a uh, Heli? I think you can. Let me just uh, hide in the corner. Oh no, you cannot uh, uh, move Helis. Right, right. Not Helis, uh, I mean Aces. Aces Heli is too big, so never mind. If you want to get rid of it, uh, Temple. But you know what, I'm probably just not going to buy Spectre because I think it's too dangerous. Again, ZMGs and stuff are still pretty pretty rough, so I'll just uh, Churchill ability. That should clean up real quick. Alright, pop count check. Yep, never misses stealing the show. As I expected, to nobody's surprise. ZDTs. Okay, that's actually kind of weird. Well, actually not weird. Uh, again, cluster darts do not damage the same balloon. So maybe that's why ZDTs just ran over us. Kind of weird. I thought we'd have enough, but yeah. Again, you need the single target. I'll just use Church's ability to instantly win. Just kidding. Alright, uh, let's try another uh, cluster tower. I want to try Super Monkey. That is just good enough. Good mob damage on its own, even without the cluster. But with the cluster, I mean, even better for groups. So watch this. Uh, I'll still use Churchill. There we go, that was close. But look at all those plasma walls. Now that's a lot of damage. Do we dare do Sun Avatar? Because I think that would be pretty nutty. I think we do. But not for a while, I feel like. We're fine for now, with just Plasma. There's just too many projectiles from the, uh, the darts. I believe it's, uh, 8. If it's the same as Cluster Bomb, Cluster shoots 8, right? Does it say? Well, you can see the picture, yes, it's 8. So, 12 times 8. 96 darts per attack for this guy. No wonder there's so much lag. Again, DTs are still a problem, so... Let me see what I wanna do. We're probably dead, if I'm being honest. Okay, if we die here, I'm gonna buy a Sun Avatar. And, uh, okay, let me just try one more time. Alright, Churchill. Come on. We're falling behind. Ouch, we lost a one green. You know what? Screw it, Sun Avatar. Watch and see the destruction unfold. Oh, uh, we still died. I guess we gotta use abilities then. Actually, I'll buy Knockback. Knockback. Slow down DTs. That probably helps. Alright, how about now? Better? Um, still pretty rough, so I'll use Churchill. I'll use Churchill, right? But yeah, that that's pretty sick. That Sun Avatar Cluster, you love to see it. Frankly, I don't think it was as OP as I expected, but it's still pretty solid. Can't complain. Oh my god, the lag. Yeah, this is only with mods. Like, in a normal game, even if you have this many projectiles, it doesn't lag as badly. I guess maybe we're underestimating the amount of projectiles in a modded game. Not gonna lie, it's super satisfying looking at this, uh, Sun Avatar shooting. It is very, very lovely. Should get a call to arms. Uh, yeah, I should. I should get a homeland with all this money. You know what? I don't actually mind that as like a get out of jail free card. I mean, plus I have 85k. I don't think there's any harm in buying it. For when you really want to unload. Let's try again. What's another tower you think we should add? I'll buy this. I think earlier someone wants to see tack. If it works. So, I guess I'll give it a shot. We'll, we'll just start with overdrive, that's it. A little 2 zero, 4 Do the attacks cluster themselves? I cannot see under all that balloon action. But it does help against CAT, so I guess I'll just drop it again. And use the ability. Oh, I got attack zone, what the hell? Um, I'll take it. Can't tell if it actually did again cluster, but... Okay, how about, how about now? 
No, it doesn't cluster. So that was kind of a waste of money, but uh, who cares? We'll be fine. And yes, we didn't get home like as we restarted last round. And we probably don't have enough uh, bad damage, do we? No, we don't. Let's try again. I probably shouldn't have kept tax zone. Well, I guess we'll get rid of it with the I shouldn't have been. But it doesn't sell for money, right? Oh, it does it. It sells for money, right? Even if you I shouldn't I, I, I don't quite remember. On chimps it doesn't, right. Alright. Alright, I'm just gonna do a simple call to arms. And is that enough? Holy Batman lag. Nah. Alright. Let me find something... Something else. Again, you, you can't uh, increase single target damage with this, so it's not that OP. Alright, we'll just alpha buff. And call it a day. And call to arms. Let's see. Alright. I think I have a... Uh, another tower we should try. How about a Dark Knight? More Super Monkey action. Why not? Feels like we need it. I'll go to call. I'll go for Call to Arms 2 as well. Still. Good news is we have Dark Shift 2 if things get really, really bad. Hopefully it shouldn't though. Come on. It's gotta be enough, man. It's gotta be. I think DDTs are gonna be a problem. DDTs, please. Uh, there we go. And uh, to beat this last part, I'm just gonna shin up the Avatar. We're getting desperate, I know. We're getting very desperate. Very desperate, but hey, we, you gotta do what you gotta do. Hopefully we'll get a terrorist back in range uh, in time. I'll try my best to get him back. Alright. So I got a Churchill 10 here, I think. I'll use called arms. Oh, the Avatar doesn't hit uh, DTs. Okay, I'll change that. Alright, I'll, I'll use called arms here, I think. Still not good enough, okay. Wow, we're getting really destroyed by these single target balloons. Alright, we'll drop an extra Alp buff. Alp buff always works well with a uh, single target, I guess. Please. There we go, that took a long time to beat. Now let's get our towers back in range. I doubt we're going to actually Chinook Ice any of these towers to get rid of them. Because I feel like we need everything. All the power we, we, like, we need. We need it. I can't just get rid of towers and get zero money from it because, yeah. Again, the fact that it can't reapply to the same tower or same balloon means it's a lot weaker than it might actually look. If anything, it just looks super crazy. Maybe sometimes satisfying, depending on the tower. Oh my god. Uh, the leg just hit like a truck this round. I don't know why. Sometimes it's weird like that. Maybe it's just the density of balloons that round. Again, I don't quite memorize these rounds, so... Maybe, maybe they're pretty, they're pretty dense. But yeah, any grouped round it destroys, because again, th like, the other projectiles beside it, or the balloons beside each other, they're gonna get wiped. Now, was there any other tower that people want to see? Last chance. Primary expertise, do you think? That's actually a pretty interesting idea. Again, the only problem would be a single target. Like, I'm dead to fortified. Fortified bads if I don't go buy an Elim, to be honest. So, I actually think I'm just gonna hold on to the money. Because, yeah, I'm not gonna beat, like, even 119 if I keep going meme towers. Not meme towers, but just towers that aren't good against bad. So, I might have to buy, like, an Elim eventually. I don't know. Actually, I kind of wonder how abilities... I guess abilities do cluster, depending on the, uh, the tower. So, like... Maelstrom. How about Boomerang? Oh, that's a good one. I completely forgot about that one. Um, I'll probably drop it. I don't know if I want to get a Perma Charge. The money's probably not there. But I think I'm definitely going to get... How about a Turbo Charge? Just to show you. I took a look at it, and it's pretty satisfying. But you cannot quite see it under uh, all those Never Miss uh, projectiles. Again, they still get in the way, pretty much. They're blocking the entire view. Come on. I'll use the Turbo Ability. Take a look at how many... How many glaives there are. I guess that'll give you an idea. They do open and close in a pretty uh, satisfying pattern as well. Satisfaction level uh, off the charts for Boomerang. We're dying to ceramics, guys. Pinks, okay. Now, I don't want to drop slow down, but... I think I'm just going to go for the Elim now, because I think I pretty much need it if I want to be at 119. And you also get, you know, Maulers. Maulers shot shooting in eight directions. Again, you can't target the same balloon, so it doesn't really help in that matter, but... Might make a little difference this round, if a balloon gets really far. I gotta make sure to time the abilities. You know, I'll use Call of Arms. It's probably the best way out of this. This silly round. My goodness. Be good now, right? Is that all DTs? Um, I think so. I might I might try Spike Storm too, if I have the money to. I probably will. Like, I'm gonna get Elim now. And let's hope there's money for, like, a, spa a Spactory of any kind in four rounds. Because, again, I don't think that, uh... Spike Storm works with the Cluster mod, but I guess it's not 
not a bad thing to at least try. These DTs are killing me, by the way. There's Elim. That should help a lot. I mean, a lot. So much lag. Crazy. 117. Let me drop Churchill. Looking pretty rough. Not bad. Yeah, I probably don't have enough money for a Spike Storm, looking at the... Well, money I got right now. Yeah, this round we're obliterating because the DTs are pretty... Uh, clumped together. And here we go, bad time. Let's see, so the ability doesn't do anything. I don't believe it's a projectile. And it only does, yeah, 100 per shot, sadly. We'll use, uh, everything. Everything we can do. I will drop a factory while I'm at it. Can't buy Spike Storm, but I guess the damage does help. Now, we're probably dead. I'm definitely going to need to... This? Dark Shift? Ah, uh, yeah, it's over. It's over, unless I can somehow clutch up. Actually, oh, uh, uh, uh. Avatar on the back. There's a chance. We got a chance, guys. Don't say it's over till it's over. I can Dark Shift 2, guys. And this will be very tight. Very tight. Come on. Wow. That was, well, probably as close as you can get without losing. Nice. Nice. So again, in case you couldn't tell, this mod isn't as OP as it may look, but that's okay. At the end of the day, we still did it. This round's easy, right? Yeah, this round's a joke. Good game. There's the cluster mod. Maybe we'll return uh, eventually to do, uh, I guess, towers that we didn't try already, but I think we covered most of the goodies at this point. Who knows, maybe we'll combine some mods as well. We'll see.